from Centerville Trailer Parts. Uh, today I wanted to teach you how to order an axle um, in case you break yours or the bearings burn out and it destroys your spindle on the end. And um, there's just two measurements that you really need to get an axle, um, order it online from us or, or come to the store. So here's what you need to do. If when you're, it's easier if you take the axle off the trailer to measure things but if you don't you have to do it from your back these are your spring seats okay you're going to see them mounted and welded to your axle under your trailer okay there's going to be one on each side and how you measure your axle and the measure for the axle is you need to measure the distance between the center of this hole and the center of this hole okay and that would be your spring center measurement. Okay, so you just take your measurement, okay, from there to there. This is if it's off and it's easy to do. If not, measure from the outside of this one, okay, if you're doing it on your back underneath your trailer, okay, to the beginning of this one, okay, of the start. So if you're gonna measure on your back, you wanna go from the outside of one to the inside of the other. That's gonna give you the same exact measurement, okay? Right. Now, once you've got that measurement, okay, I have these off, but these will be welded on just like the ones on yours when you receive your new axle. It's just for teaching. Now, the next thing you need to do is you need to know your hub face. Okay, this is a hub, okay, as you probably have on yours, or you have brakes, so you'll have a full brake drum on there but what you need is your hub face measurement which of course as you know this will be sitting on here okay so you're going to take your measurement from here right where the start of your okay your studs are right at the bottom of them on that flat surface all the way to the other side of the same thing on that side and now that's going to be your hub face measurement and those are the two measurements you really need to get the axle that you need. Whether it's be brakes or not brakes, it doesn't matter. That's what you need to measure. The, uh, the axle is gonna have a bend in, and I want you to realize that your broken one might not, but as you can see, see how my fingers can fit under here, okay? This is bent on it for a reason. The weight of your trailer is on top of this. So you're, this is up. Okay, this is facing up your bend so it can handle the weight pushing down on it. Okay, so don't think you got a bad axle that came in the mail or whatever. Uh, it was bent or something. That's the way it's supposed to be. Okay, and of course your spring centers, your spring seats, you're either going to have them on the top or the bottom. Most of the time they're called underslung. They're going to be on the bottom like this. Okay, if not, we have a kit that can switch them over to the top. So you can ask for that also. And this last thing is, if you need hubs, we have them also online. We can order them all. If you ripped up the bearings and your spindle, which happens a lot, and you can buy the whole hub with bearings, everything in them, greased, ready to go. You just pop it on and you tighten your nut and you're off for going and you're all set. Uh, one thing I wanted to go over first is, this is a 3,500 pound axle. Probably the most common one out there. It's all your landscapers use this. Um, you know, your uh, tree cutting, you know, flatbeds, all of that. But we sell all different sizes, of course. So you got to find out what size you have, which it should say on your sticker, okay, uh, what pound trailer. You should know. It'll say it also on the sticker on the trailer, um, which so if it says, uh, you know, 7,000 pounds is, is going to be your two axles, which would mean two 3,500 pound axles. We also um, have the big ones, this, the 5,200, the six, and the 7,000 pound axles. So no matter what size it is, um, find out that first, because that's going to be uh, very important to know. And um, yeah, that's it. We can uh, help you in any way. Um, please check our website out and... Uh, 
We will talk to you soon, okay? So long.